On this lesson, we're going to show you how to put up a small piece of frosted film. This is our Apex um, Classic Sandblasted Film. Uh, we're going to put it on this side, just like that. A little trick when um, taking the line off of the film. A couple pieces of masking tape work really well. One on the back, one on the front. Look at that. A couple tries. That's going to reveal the sticky side and make it really easy to pull that off. Okay. On a previous um, uh, videotape, we showed you how to clean the window, so I hope you already watched that one. <laughs> it's uh, kind of an important uh, issue. Um, so once the window is clean, we've got our soapy water solution. You're going to give it a light spray. Don't spray it too much because if there's any dirt around the edge, um, it tends to bleed down a little bit. With frosted film, it's not a big concern, but if you're going to put up some solar film, you're going to need that, that uh, window as perfect as possible, so you're going to get a good result. So I've taken the liner off, off that, as you can see. We're going to spray down this side as well. So everything's nice and wet and soapy. Um, when we do installations, we pre-cut all the film uh, in nice squares so that uh, this minimizes the amount of uh, effort we have to put into the installation because we can simply tuck that right up in that corner, like so, and uh, we're only going to have to trim the right side and the bottom. So once the film's up, it's going to kind of hold itself up there just with uh, its own adhesives and whatnot. You can use a squeegee or a hard card. Just You're going to try and get start to get the water out keep that window film in place. I like to keep the surface of the window nice and wet because all my tools are designed to work on a wet film, not a dry. Dry it'll grab and scratch the film. So starting at the top center, I'm going to push the water out a little bit. Sort of work it from the sides and down. Don't go right to the side until you're ready to trim. Because if you do, again, the capillary action of the water is going to draw some contaminant out. If there's anything there, a little bit of dust, maybe a paint chip or whatnot. So don't push right to the edge, just maybe half an inch on a window like that. So now it's basically anchored in place. And what you're going to need next is, um, you know, this is a, a snap-off blade. They're pretty common. You can get them just about anywhere. Make sure it's good and, good and sharp. Always, you know, whenever I start a new window, I just snap a new, a new piece off. One little trick I've discovered is um, corners are the trickiest part with um, w when you're trimming the film. So just gently push your finger into the corner, and then look to where that's going to be, and and slice away. This is going to make it a lot easier when you when you when you come to trim the side and the bottom. So, using your hard card as a guide, you're going to tuck the film in, and then simultaneously with, with the blade, just run it down the window like that. Right to the very bottom. Same thing along the bottom. Okay. So that's all going to come away. And easy. And there you go. One frosted little window. On the final stage, you're going to want to put a little bit more pressure on, and you're not going to want to keep wetting the window. So just get a bit of paper towel and wrap it around the edge of your tool. This is going to protect your film when you put a bit more pressure on. And again the edge. There you go. Trimmed right to the edge. Looks like a piece of sandblasted glass.